Hello, amazing people. Would you like to react with me? To Bo Burnham can't handle this. You asked, and I listen. The list is long. <laughs> How are you? I hope you're doing okay. You're amazing. It's so fun doing this with you. Let's get going. Maybe I, I look tired because it's morning and I just I woke up like from sleeping into reacting. <laughs> I just wanted to do that. So let's react. Can't handle this. Bo Burnham. Thank you for the recommendation. Let's check it out. I went to Kanye West recent tour, the Yeezus tour. It was a big, dramatic, theatrical show. He did something very strange at the end of his show where he ranted for like 20 minutes. It was kind of a rant, kind of a song. He had auto-tune on his voice, and there was an instrumental in the background. Like this instrumental. So cute. <laughs> Talk about his problems. Race. He matured. I mean, I, I'm just jumping into the Bo Burnham rabbit hole as one of you said in the comments, and I embraced. I don't know him. All I know is inside, and I'm not even done with that. So, let's go. So he looks cute, and inside, it's after the process. He looks a lot more mature. Power. His $90 t-shirts weren't selling very well. That was most of it. And I watched this. <laughs> $90 t-shirt. I thought maybe I could do this. Brand. I'll be honest, my problems are not as high stakes as Kanye's, but I have problems. And maybe a crowd in New York would be nice enough to indulge me. So as we get to the end of a night of theater and comedy and sweaters coming on and off, I got one question for you. And that question is... Can I say my shit? Say my I got He's the bravest man alive <laughs> because it seems to me like his art cannot be separated from his truth and that's not something that can be told on everyone I mean I think a lot of the famous people out there with the power to, to make a change just do what everyone likes but Bo always turns stuff around like when he says one thing you know that the fist is coming from the other end let's see I can't fit my hand inside a Pringle can I have a huge amount of trouble fitting my hand inside of a Pringle can. I can get my hand like four inches into the can, but then I have to tilt the can into my mouth. <laughs> but by that point, a bunch of crumbs have accumulated at the bottom of the can. So they all go spill it onto my face. What I'm trying to say is the diameter of Pringle cans is way too small. I'll say it again, the diameter of Pringle cans is way too small. Two radiuses of a Pringle can is way too small. Listen, I'm a motivational speaker and a therapist, so... Like, every second on the stage matters. And that's exactly what he's doing. I mean, this song is... Kanye West, right? It's, uh, he's saying he's all these troubles and Bo is doing the same but it's Bo he's not talking about he's talking about Pringles but it's the fact that he has the power to influence and he's talking about Pringles that makes it a lot more sophisticated in my opinion maybe I'm overreacting to <laughs> to Pringles, but he's lingering on that, stretching it, because there are a lot more important things in the world, and Pringles is just uh, a smokescreen. Oh, if you feel me, put your hands up, 
Come on. If you feel me, put your hands up. Everyone. Look at all these it's hands a show. that are way too big to fit inside a Pringle can. Your hands are too big to fit inside a Pringle can. Your hands are too big to fit inside a Pringle can. You think you can, I know you can. You think you can. Such a Pringles, listen to the people. I am sure 90% of the complaint letters you get are about the width of your cans. Just make them wider. I've overdone the Pringles thing. Sorry. I want to have a daughter. Want to have a daughter. So I can finally have someone around the house who can fit their hands in a Pringle can. Yes, I'm still on the Pringle cans thing. Yeah. <laughs> I'll, I'll move on, all right? <laughs> but that is priority <laughs> numero uno. I don't go to the gym because I'm self-conscious about my body. But I'm self-conscious about my body because I don't go to the gym. Irony can be so painful. That's a catch-22. Let's do this. I went to Chipotle, went to Chipotle, got myself a chicken burrito. I went down the line, I got like all these ingredients, and then at the end of the line, the guy tried to wrap the burrito, wrapped the shit inside the burrito, spilled out, he still wrapped it. I was like, dude, you should have warned me. You're a burrito expert, you should have told me halfway through, hey man, you might be reaching maximum burrito capacity here. Do you think I want a messy burrito? No one wants a messy burrito. The whole appeal of a burrito is that all of the ingredients are contained within the confines of the tortilla. The dramatic I wouldn't music. have gotten half this shit we're if talking I knew it was going to fit in the burrito. And burrito. Right, look, I wouldn't have got the lettuce if I knew it wouldn't fit. Wouldn't have got the cheese if I knew it wouldn't fit. Wouldn't have got the peppers if I knew they wouldn't fit. I wouldn't have got, 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 got half of it like I'm okay with small mistakes if you got no or chicken, I'll take pork, but I'll blow my dad before I eat a burrito with a fork. Wouldn't I get the lettuce if I knew it wasn't? Wouldn't I get the cheese if I knew it wasn't? Wouldn't I get the peppers if I knew they wouldn't? Then I wouldn't have got half of it like, half of it like, half of it like, all eyes on me, talking about nothing. I think it's time, I think it's time that we break it down. He's not talking about burritos. It's both. <laughs> I can sit here and pretend like my biggest problems are Pringle cans. There you go. The burritos. The truth He's so is smart. my biggest problems. You when you have the stage and you talk about nonsense and you're so smart and you use the entire scene to make everyone in tune with you even though you're talking about Pringles and burritos now you can drop some bombs I wanna please you but I wanna stay true to myself mm. I wanna give you the night out that you deserve but I wanna say what I think and not care what you think about it a part of me loves you part of me hates you so part of me needs you part of me fears you and i don't think that i can handle this so right brave. now handle this right now i don't think that i can handle this right now i don't think that i can handle this right now i don't think that i can handle this right now. I don't think that I can handle this right So look at them, they're just staring at me like Come and watch the skinny kid with a steadily declining mental health And laugh as he attempts to give you what he cannot give himself I think that I can handle this right I don't think that I can handle this right But they don't even know the half of this right 
but they don't even know no her for me. Enjoy the quiet that I'm providing you in the fun because I don't have a pussy. They have put on a silly show. I should probably just Only shut thoughts. up and That's do what he my has. job so I can here relate. I go. Wouldn't have got the letters if I knew it wouldn't fit. Wouldn't have got the cheese if I knew it wouldn't fit. Wouldn't have got the peppers if I knew they wouldn't fit. Wow. Wouldn't have got that. You can tell them anything if you just make it funny, make it rhyme. And if they still don't understand you, then you will run it one more time. I think that I can handle this right. Good night. I hope you're happy. I'm not happy. So brave to tell the truth. Wow. <laughs> I waited for it. I waited for it. There is no chance that a guy like this talks about something like that without a reason. Look at all this insignificant stuff while I'm breaking down mentally. And then cheer and laugh while I'm, ma while I'm, men while I'm melting down mentally. I hope you're happy because I'm not and I'm giving you what I can't give myself. Whew. Wow. Thank you so much for this recommendation. Now you see me comes six years after that. I'm not sure. I don't know. I think because he said he's, he was working on inside he said he was working on his mental health for five years then people laugh and you're like you're not listening that's the problem you're seeing you're not seeing the true person that's it I can talk about this for hours <laughs> thank you so much for this recommendation this was Bo Burnham can't handle this thank you so much you're amazing it was so fun reacting with you and I'm going to see you in the next reaction video. See you then.